夏の講習会もまだまだ受付中枠が限られていますのでお早めに Hello, my name is Mr. Deer and this is an Inter Thomas Dictation Challenge. Today we will be listening to the trees. Trees. We look at them, but do we really see them? They are quite large and often very old. In fact, the average tree weighs about one to six tons, which is the equivalent of the average elephant. And like elephants, they have trunks and they can walk. That's right, the trees in Ecuador walk. The soil is very bad, so the roots spread to firm ground and then the trunk shifts towards them. The other roots don't hold it back because they get raised into the air for the step. Now, this process takes years, but they do walk. Not only do they walk, but they also talk. To each other through the fungi, through the mushroom layer. If there is a sick tree, the other trees will find out and begin to prepare their defenses against the disease. And also, mother trees feed, they give nutrients to their daughters when they're in trouble, again, through the fungi. So the trees, they, they walk, they talk, they also like music. Australian studies with house plants, mind you, but trees aren't quite so different from them, found that if you play traffic noise constantly in the room, the plants, they will die. It's not good. But if you play music constantly, that is even better than silence. They grow much better with music. So the trees are listening to us as well. They can hear water and the roots go towards the sound of the water. This has been tested with recorded water sounds and they will move towards it. So they're listening, they're speaking. But are we listening? The ancient Greeks used to go to the oak of Dodona and listen to the wind in the leaves to hear the voice of the gods. I wonder if we learned how to understand them, what the trees would say. <laughs>